Welcome, Welcome to the view. To the view. Do, 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 do. Um, from lovely Patterson, blah blah blah, etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. So we are here we're, today. We're gonna do a pride, a gay pride. Yeah, we are. No, wrap actually, up. this is a shame. We we were uh, gay shame. Gay shame. Up. Yes, we were ashamed. We were so ashamed to be homosexuals. Homosexual shame. Well, you know, our whole society is set up, as we said in another, right. another sure. episode, to shame us and make us feel... Make us fall in line. And make us feel neurotic. So, um, we, outraged by the party group, we had a, a... We were part of the parade, the gay parade, the gay pride parade. I cannot believe you were in the gay pride parade, or that you even showed up in time to Well, be, I was there. To be there. And um, we were uh, on a... We had a convertible with an outraged uh, uh, banner. Banner. And um and Which will stickers. flash on the screen. Uh huh. And um, we were, you know, they, you're ta- you're like taxiing on the runway to be taking off until before the, at right. The, I mean, it's like hours of waiting. Yeah. So uh, we were waiting. We were like three to be to go on. And I get a phone call from the movers. We were moving from Brooklyn to this new loft, and um, they said, "What do you want us to do with the other property?" And I said, "Well." Unload it and put it in the apartment. And they said, "Well, there's nobody here to accept the move." The, the, you know, and I said, "Where's Kyoki?" And they said, um, "We don't know." And um, I called Kyoki, and after a few um, very, um, uh, shall we say, heated discussions, um, it was determined that I had to get off of the of the float and take an Uber to New Jersey to accept the movers and, um, uh, you know. We got our all of belongings. I couldn't get here in time. And when I got here, all of our worldly possessions were piled in the streets in front of the loft. Oh, wow. Did anything mm-hmm. get stolen? I, well, I mean, I don't know because I don't think so, but I haven't, you know. Well, luckily, just from the picture that you showed me, it all looked like a bunch of junk. Well, it's going to look like that way because it, it looks, anything piled up like that will look like a bunch of junk. Um, well, that's a good thing because then people might not think well, yes. that it's valuable. Yes. Um, so, um... Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I mean, were there valuables there? Well, yeah, I, I mean, there was all of my paintings that they were there. Um, there were um, my collection of night. Luckily, nobody in this neighborhood well, they were, probably they, would want your paintings. They were, um, <laughs> they were boxed out. You couldn't see them. But um, it was, I, yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it was nerve wracking. You know, speeding along the highway in rush hour right. traffic, and right, you can't right. get there. And knowing that your stuff is like... Right, you know, it was Sunday, like a million cars. Yeah, out. and Everybody like in, in probably the town with like the worst, um, you know, crime rate, like in, 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 in New Jersey. Or in the country, I don't know. Yeah, and, um, and And knowing that all your stuff is like there, and probably like, you know, crackheads, like picking through your stuff, like, you know, it was nerve wracking. So, um, so yeah, so we got here and, um, and um, I was not happy about that. Long story mm-hmm. short... Nobody stole the Hitler painting. Um, no, they didn't. They were, no, they did not. They did not see the value in the "Come on, Hitler" painting. Come on, Hitler! Come on, Hitler! I'm in this moment. Come on, Hitler! Come on. So who Hitler. did end up on the outrage float? Oh, I didn't even um, see the outrage. I was at the parade. I didn't see it. It was warly. Oh, and as we were going down the thing, or the, as the front float was going down the thing. There were club kids on the side that that were that were recognized and pulled up onto the car. So um, it was Warley and Natasha and Hannah and um, and uh, uh, Warley, Natasha, and Hannah were the three main. Uh, That's it. Yeah, I'm trying to remember. Uh, at what point did I'm trying to remember what point in the parade I might have seen the float? Like well, what, what part of the we parade were, were you in? The we were middle going around? on at. Um, it was about four o'clock that we were that our you were supposed to come out. Yeah, that was when we were. They were saying we were like three. There were three. Oh, us. that's really late. Yeah, it was really late. Oh, I think by that point I might have left to go. We were to funny go enough, get more drunk. We were with the sanitation workers. <laughs> the trash. trash out with the trash. <laughs> the trash with the trash. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think by that point I might have left the parade to go get more drunk at the uh, at the new gay bar rebar. That's new. Well, it's a bar that is the former G Lounge, and we really? went there to have a drink because but that's it, where I met my husband. Isn't Rebar so, like that was something uh, before? Rebar was a it was a club bar on Eighth Avenue by Sixteenth Street. Have we really come to that? That we're opening new clubs and calling and them calling old, them old names, names, right? I mean, well, I don't know if they intentionally called it Rebar after that. That's even worse. <laughs> the Rebar, or if they're just thinking, hey, we'll just call our 
bar yeah, after, cut it. after the metal rods that are in concrete. Yeah, that's probably it. We'll be right back. And now a word from our sponsor. Back to the view, metal rod, rod, concrete. Metal rods, concrete. Yeah. Night club, we got it. You're it all here. <laughs> metal <Okay>. rods. Concrete. <laughs> concrete, metal rods. Yeah, what could be more fun? <laughs> Go get your metal rods stuck in concrete. <laughs> I've had my metal <laughs> rods stuck in concrete. It wasn't yeah. pretty. It was not pretty. Yeah. So. <laughs> Well, I left the Gay Pride Parade to go have a celebratory drink at the bar that's named after another bar. And then uh, I ended up going home and taking Molly. That was how I celebrated Gay Pride. And then uh, I got so high Did you take it alone? No, I took it with uh, friends. How many? Just a couple. Who were they? Uh, I'm not going to say. Why? It was a private party. So, just people who lived with you? Members only. Just people who lived with you? No. People who don't live with you? Uh, I'm not saying... So anyway, I got so high that I couldn't go out to the party. I'm thinking it's got to be your husband. No, he he wouldn't do that. He didn't do all. No, no? He, he was chaperoning. Oh. Like we had to have like one safe person in the house that so that, like a, you know that could call nine one one. Like a lawyer. <laughs> what? Like a lawyer? No, we needed to have like one chaperone. Yeah, like a lawyer. No, like one sober person. Like a lawyer. No, not a lawyer. No. 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 No, no. A chaperone. A chaperone. No, they are. All right, don't be trying to do that. I mean, chaperones <laughs> do watch. They sure do. But <laughs> voyeurs watch something more of, a, of an erotic nature. Right, this is more that we just needed like a designated watcher uh, in, ca in case we just got out of control. In case you died or anything. Right. I yeah. mean, somebody needs to administer CPR. Yeah, or not. Uh, that's, well, that's I mean, and who can, and who, honestly, who can do CPR when you're high? I mean, oh, I can. Like, can you? Yeah. You've done it? Yeah, yeah. I um, can do it. Uh, like, I'm like going like this and all of a sudden I lose count. How many, how many like, compressions have I done? Was that 20? Um, <laughs> that's what Alex's job was always was in the Peter Gation hotel rooms. She was the chaperone. She was, and I would have to call down every two hours. She would get the floor underneath and I would have to call and say, you know, Peter's still alive. <laughs> 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 what well, was that? The, was that the safe word or the code word? No, that that meant he's still alive. Like, oh, that if you call down there, or that yeah. And if I didn't call, I was supposed to call every two hours to let her know that he's still alive. Yeah. Okay. And if he died, you weren't supposed to call. Oh, well, then I was supposed to call sooner, probably. <laughs> I don't know he never died, so we never get to figure that out. Mm -hmm. But <laughs> but I assumed that I was supposed to call if he died, when he died. <laughs> okay. Glad you didn't have to make that call. Yeah, I was all with my. I mean, who? Oh, what about it? Ruined everything. So, um, so tell us about the, your um, your orgy that you had on. Um, it wasn't an orgy. Your Molly orgy. No, it was just we were just hanging out at home. Just hanging out. Rolling on Molly. Rolling on Molly. It was fun. And what'd you do? Oh, we watched TV and did we you? listened to music. Did and, you? Yeah. No, you didn't. No, we did. <sighs> Don't you? I'm gonna have, have to. I'm gonna have to teach you how to have a house. Haven't you ever like stayed at home and just like done ecstasy? Yes, or but not with a romantic interest. Uh, but sometimes it's just fun to do like playful things. What does that mean, playful? You know, you're just like playing games. Like what kind of games? Like baby games. Tiddlywinks. Baby games. Like tiddlywinks. 
Baby face. You look really creepy when you say that. <laughs> Baby face. <laughs> you look really creepy. My husband says that about me. You are creepy. <laughs> you're like a... You're like... He you're calls like it a, my Vincent Price voice. <laughs> <laughs> and you are probably just like him. Like like Peter Lorre. Like a, like a, a creepy old pedophile. <laughs> okay. Uh, there are no underage people in my home. Okay. At least not since you've lived there. Uh, I don't. I, I Oh, I know people think I'm. They, they card me all the time. Yeah, that's what people. Think. <laughs> that's exactly what people, people think. think yeah. that I'm, people think I'm. People think I'm under twenty-one. Yes, yeah, so we know what people think. <laughs> they think I'm under twenty-one. They voice it quite loudly <laughs> and succinctly on think, social media. Including the Pew Channel. <laughs> and we'll see you next time. Bye.